often have clients come in with children who have special needs. And what, do I, what do I mean by special needs? Well, there's multiple things. There's obviously a child who has uh, some sort of handicap where they cannot function on their own. They may receive disability, they may not. There are also children who have drug problems, um, other sort of mood issues, psychological problems. Uh, what I really mean by special needs is somebody who cannot take care of themselves and are gonna need help for the rest of their lives, typically. Now, there's ways to plan for this as parents. Obviously, you don't want to just leave their inheritance to them as you would any of your other children because they might spend that inheritance. Uh, they, they may not be able to take care of themselves the rest of their lives on that inheritance if they spend it. So what you do is you put in place a special needs trust. Now, one of the key elements of this special needs trust is even if your child is not on disability currently, you want to plan for the uh, event that they receive that from the government. And you want to plan for it in a way where it's outside of their estate so that they it's not counted as part of their assets and does not disqualify them.